What's going on guys? Criminal Justice here and today I'm going to be showing you how to download and install the 5M server. Let's do it. What's going on guys? Criminal Justice here and today I'm going to be showing you how to download the 5M server. God bless you guys. God bless America. God bless our troops that are fighting for our freedom. God bless our veterans. God bless Israel. So guys, I've got my baby girl in the room with me here. My 11 month old. She is going to be 1 December 18th. She will be 1 years old guys. Can you believe it? Time flies by so fast, guys. Just it seems like just yesterday she was born, and I was holding my arms for the first time. It's it's just, time is just crazy fast. Anyway, guys, she is in here with me. She's right here beside me in her playpen, and she is the best baby in the world. Isn't that right, Ray Ray? Isn't that right? She's the best baby in the world, guys. Couldn't ask for a better baby. System. Seriously, guys. Anyways, I'm going to show you guys how to download the 5M server. For those of you that do not know how to do this, um, there's a lot of people out there that do want to get in the role play uh, community, and I'm going to show you how to do that today. So I left a link in the description below for the 5M with the 5M link there. It says 5M uh, link, I believe. Just click that, and it's going to bring you to this page right here. Now, if it does not bring you to this, um, which it should, but if it doesn't, uh, there should be, you should be able to go to GitHub right here, and it'll bring you right to this. I believe that's how you do it, um, or the uh, forum. One of the two guys. But anyway, what you want to do when you get to this, this page right here is this is what you want to do, guys. You want to click Download Client, okay? And it's just going to do its thing from here. So click Download Client, all right? And you're going to click Sure, I Agree. All right. Now... This does have a wizard set up, so we are going to save it and run it. Now, however, you can save this to your downloads folder or click Save As and put it where you'd like. So go ahead and click Save. And then instead of opening the folder, we're going to go ahead and click Run. Okay. Now, it's going to start booting everything up and downloading everything. It does take a minute, guys, to do this. But... um. It does get done, guys. It just it just takes a little bit. But it's worth it. I mean, I've honestly, I've been in one role play server in my whole life, guys. And, and it was just for just a few minutes. Um, I never really got to do anything. I, I basically was in, this is how long I was in a role play server, guys. Okay, you're, you're probably going to laugh at me. And that's fine because it's kind of funny anyway. But but uh, th what happened was I went to this role play server for just like a few seconds. Just long enough to jump off the top of a mountain, slide down, and die. And then I left the server. That was it. <laughs> so when I spawned in, it spawned me on top of the mountain at Sandy Shores, the big mountain over there by... Um... All right, so right here, guys, um, you're just going to click yes. If you want to read over that, you can, but uh, just click yes. It's going to verify it and, and let it go ahead and do its thing. But... That's that's what it basically was, guys. I spawned in Sandy Shores, if you guys know what I'm talking about. It's right there on top of the mountain, uh, right near Mount Chiliad. It's close to that. And I spawned there close to Mount Chiliad on top of a huge mountain. And I jumped. And when I did, um, I slid down the mountain and I died. Because when I get, like, if I ever start, like, a new, um, like, an online game and I have to build my, st my character stamina and all that... That's the first thing I do is I work on their stamina. So my plan was is I was going to jump and then land and just start taking off running. But unfortunately, it didn't work out like that. I ended up actually falling over and sliding to my death. So that's how long I've basically been in a role play server, guys, in my entire career on doing this type of stuff, okay? So, uh, but I actually thought about getting into a role play server just to get some practice yeah, and see what I think that's actually like. it right there, guys. So once that is done... It's going to load your GT5 into it because it has to read that. That's where the, the 5M server goes to. All right. And then you guys are safe to go ahead and close out of this. Go ahead and close out of that. All right. Now, if you notice on your desktop, you have the two icons here I was talking about. And all of a sudden, 5M is going to pop up on your screen. Okay. 
Let me turn my volume down just a little bit, guys, in case the music kicks on. Now, sometimes, now, if you hear music, then that's normal. See, I'm hearing music right now. So here's what I want you to do, guys. If it doesn't load up, which more than likely if you're set to auto-select graphics, and I don't know what kind of graphics card you have, it's probably not going to fire right up, okay? So this is what I want you guys to do, okay? Because you can't go ahead and just close out of that 5M. Now, here's what I want you guys to do to make your 5M work. If your 5M did not load right into the forum to where you see all your servers, all the servers that are available, this is what I want you guys to do, okay? Just simply go on your desktop right here and right click. And then if you have uh, NVIDIA control panel, which is the NVIDIA GeForce Experience, if you have that, then do this with me, okay? If you don't and you have a different kind of graphics card, then join my Discord for support and they can probably help you out with that, okay? Um, so anyway, what you want to do, guys, for the, the NVIDIA GeForce Experience users... You're going to right-click on your desktop. You're going to go into NVIDIA Control Panel, just like that. All right. And it's going to bring up this window right here. Now, you see right here, guys, where it says Program Settings and then Global Settings? Make sure you're on Global Settings. Here's what you want to do, guys. Just simply click this tab right here. Tab here. We're going to go to High Performance NVIDIA Processor. You're going to click apply. And then just give it a second to go through. And there it is. That's done. Right. Now look guys, what I was saying while I go, if you want to restore it, all you have to do is click this tab again and go back to auto select. Or you can click restore right here and it'll restore your natural, your uh, default graphics, okay? So let's, let's close out of that. And then let's go ahead and try to fire up 5M again. Okay, so let's do 5M. And here we go. I know All right, so there is the 5M server, guys. It is up. So it does have to be on the NVIDIA processor graphics, all right? I knew it was one of them. Um, so here is your 5M server, guys. All right, guys, let me turn that music down. There's a way to turn that music off. Let me see if I can remember how to do it. I think it's in settings. Uh, let's see, main menu, audio, enable background music. One. Okay, yeah. Click that. If you don't want the music on, guys, just click that out right there, and there you go. Woo, that's much better. I can't stand that music going off in my ear like that, guys. Don't change anything else, guys. Everything else is, is pretty much uh, set to default. I mean, you. I guess you can click this right here and make the interface. Use the dark theme. That you can actually like use the dark theme like that. See how that is? That's pretty cool. Uh, and then you go to... This is right right here, guys. Direct Connect is if you already have an IP address to a server. You would just copy that, that link and then paste it right here, and it would pull that server up that you're going to, and you just join it like that. Now, this is for your favorites. When you find a, when you find a, uh, a server that you like, you can put it in here. And then these are all of your servers. This is the servers right here, guys. See all this stuff right here? Look at this, guys. This is nothing but role play servers. Now I do want to make note guys, I want you guys to take note, over here you can pick your language, okay? So it's got any language that, that you can find in here. Um, of course, I'm going to select um, English, all right? So this is all English servers right here. So now keep in mind guys, for those of you that don't know anything about this, or maybe you do and you don't know this part about it, some servers, um, some servers, require you to fill out an application and it's a process it takes uh, you know a few days or so to get accepted however some servers you can just go into okay but that's what i wanted to show you guys i mean that's pretty much it just remember to change your graphics card over to the invit was it the nvidia processor graphics is that what it was anyway guys just want to show you that real quick uh thank you for joining my video today guys i appreciate the love and support i appreciate you guys showing up and um thank you so much guys i love y'all Links in the description below. Twitter, Instagram, Discord, PayPal's down there. If you guys throw a few dollars my way, I'd, I'd appreciate it. I appreciate if you join my Instagram, my Twitter, my my Discord. Follow me on Twitter and Instagram, guys. I'll follow you back. I will follow you back every time. All right, guys? So until next time, till next video, till next tutorial, God bless. Take care. Stay in prayer. Love one another. And peace out.